Gentlemen, 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 what up, guys? Your boy be in the lab chilling, man. Drinking pre-workout, drinking a little bit of coffee. Uh, Waiting for these football games to come on, man. Hopefully, you guys are taking care of yourselves, staying productive, staying active, um, getting your goals together for this new year. It's going to be productive, and it looks like uh, the truth will prevail going forward, man. But I want to just touch, I had a few topics I want to touch on, but I know y'all saw the, the Cat Williams deal. And, um, you know, all this is opinion. All this is opinion. You know, I, uh, <clears throat> I actually agree with Cat Williams, what he said. I agree with him. I like Shannon Sharp. You know, I don't, I don't really have a dog in the fight, but there's a lot of stuff like that. See that video. Don't be surprised to see that video hit a hundred million views, man. Don't be surprised if they squeeze every ounce of juice out of that video, because that's the narrative that they, you know, there's already a, an attack on black fathers. I wouldn't be surprised if YouTube is pumping extra views. You know, and I'm not mad at him because, you know, you have comedy gatekeepers too. the man didn't set didn't didn't tell any lies. But, you know, wise men don't want no drama. And you have a bunch of old old niggas doing young nigga shit. You, ha you know what I'm saying? Like. Instead of unity and coming together. You see what I'm saying? Like, instead of unit, like, I, I want to see the response from where this is headed, though, because there's a big picture. There's a big picture, man. And, um, and yeah, you have a lot of, um, but see, yeah, you have a lot of gatekeeper type stuff going on, not just in the comedy world, but in sports, too. Just especially in the NBA, man. Like, if the NBA didn't add the 10th seed, the Lakers or the Warriors wouldn't, they, they, they would have had to blow it up years. They wouldn't even be relevant. They're trying to squeeze like, like, like I think the Warriors in a 10th seed in the, 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 the Lake or ninth or 11th or whatever. But if this was 10 years ago, they would have had to blow it up because they wouldn't be making the playoffs. But as long as they, you know, that's like, you know, that's just like a example, but but now we just got grown men on pain. You know, I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with it. All oh, this is just my opinion. But you got grown men sitting on panels, spilling the tea, man. That's where we at. And there's already been an attack on black fathers. So instead of uniting, it don't matter. Like, see, because now the powers at B don't have to do the dirty work no more. Because you have your own people doing the dirty work. You know, like, you know, wise men don't, you don't want, we don't want, you know, once you get older, you, 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 you kind of want to shy away from the detrimental stuff because now you got, um, the younger men seeing the older men doing like okay if i do this then i'm liable to get 20 million views 100 all i gotta do is is spill the tea if you will you know and i don't know this is just my opinion i'm just talking man i'm just talking man but yeah you know and but but you know another thing too all these businesses this is why i say like Profiting off the beehive is it's going to be a tough year. If you profit off the beehive, this year is going to be bad for you. Whether it's acting, uh, comedy, uh, doing nails, doing eyelash, you know, the nail business is going to be tough. The eyelash businesses, all the businesses that you see the beehive um, spending money, Popeyes is going to be tough. Um, church's chicken is going to be tough wherever they spend money at it's going to be a it's going to be tough man but yeah don't yeah but don't be surprised because see this is the you know they could have been 
if 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 that was if if they were talking about male empowerment, YouTube would have been shut that off. They'd have been cut the water off on that. They'd have stopped that as soon as it caught traction. But that's not that's the narrative that they want to push. And this is like you may not believe this or not, but Cat Williams, truth be told, you know, I don't got nothing bad to say about him, but he's part of the beehive too, man. You may not understand it, but he he may not be part of the beehive, but he has a big beehive following, man. So, yeah, don't be surprised to see that video hit 100 million views, man. And, yeah, they're still in content. Yeah, they're still in content. They're still in jokes. And the same ones still in be the same ones flagging, too, man. But like, you know, you, you, you want to see like a positive resolution come from this. If this is the type of stuff, if we going to have a bunch of old niggas doing young nigga shit, let there be a positive resolution, man. You know, because wise men don't want no dr old niggas don't want no drama, man. But we got a bunch of old men sitting on panels. Man, just, you know, gentlemen, stay busy, stay active, stay productive, keep grinding, keep kicking, keep chopping wood, keep promoting the good work, keep fighting the good fight, gentlemen, and good stuff is going to happen. Sir, yes, sir.